being a cyclist, well, triathlete, I, um, the ride is actually cycling. So for training purposes, I'm, I just wanted to do something different and crazy. I mean, uh, we'll call it what it is. It is crazy because it is an attempt for myself. Uh, but the reason why I switched to that is because I was supposed to, or the goal was to actually race Ironman Tremblant in August of this year with Lara and her son, Michael. So she was going to do the swim part. I was going to do the cycling and her son, who probably is 20 by now, uh, was going to do the running part, but because of her health declining, she couldn't commit. So in her honor, and because I was a bit sad about her not being able to go ahead and do the race, um, I'm just going to do, I decided to do the, the Everesting on Sinham. And the, the location that I chose is also extremely nice. Like it's one of the nicest part about the, of the areas. You overlook the whole area of Hamilton. So yeah. It's all because of Lara and the fact that she can't do the race in August. I decided to actually um, do this extra challenge on top of the 1200 kilometer bike ride that we'll have May 28th. And it's also going to be a challenge in that, I mean, you're, you're such an athlete you do the challenges similar or like this, you've done stuff like this before, but this is going to be also a challenge because it might be, it's an emotional one too. There's the, that aspect to it. It is very emotional. Um, last Sunday and last week, I did a two sets of 10. That was my, that's how I trained. I unfortunately, because of the weather, I wasn't able to train as much as I wanted. Um, after I did nine, I was going up 10 and really getting emotional. So 89, if I make it to 89, I'll probably be pretty upset, but happy upset. Um, it, like when you think about people that actually have to go through pancreatic cancer, it's a bit difficult for me because I always think, why not me? Why them? I mean, she has two um, young or young adult children. Um, she's the nicest person I've ever met. One of the nicest person I've ever met. So for her to have to battle that, I, I just see it as unfair um, so yes, for me, I have to kind of try and I'm going to have to really battle the emotion going up there, but there's also going to be a lot of support. I've got a lot of friends coming over to just maybe say hi, people that have donated already, clients of mine, um, people that are going to try and attempt more than one time because the hill is not the worst, but it's also not easy. So for them to do one is already great, but they're going to try and attempt two, maybe three if possible, just because I am going to attempt doing 90. So then if for anybody who does want to support you in this journey, in this challenge, and the one coming up at the end of the month too, where can they go? How can they help? Well, they can actually um, come on Saturday if they want uh, cash donation checks or uh, there's also a link that I'll um, be able to uh, have. I'll have papers. And um, if you go to Seven Days in May, that's the name of the bike ride, Seven Days in May, and just locate my name. Um, I think the founder, Gord Townley, actually created a link specifically for me with the name Everest on it. But if not, just with my name, Patricia Peterson, on the Seven Days in May um, website to donate. I've actually increased my... Uh, goal also to five thousand dollars just because of all the um positive connection that i've got this week uh my friend julia really went out of her way to try and reach out to more people and to try and create more awareness and maybe just last question then i know you touched on it a little bit there so as as you prepare for this journey and continue on um what is what is your hope um well, my hope would be for Lara to beat this um, disease. Unfortunately, in the past few months, she's been having a really rough, uh, hitting a really rough patch. But just to, I mean, to, to cure the disease would be great to be able to find one little bits that give that little hope, extra hope to get a longer life, 